how to upload a course on Udemy to sell. Hello everyone and welcome back. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at Udemy and how you can make money with Udemy. Now, we all know that Udemy is a great platform for people that are looking to learn, but can you actually earn money with Udemy and actually sell courses on Udemy? Well, you actually can, and it's not as hard as you might think. So on Udemy, they have multiple different categories. And if you have knowledge or if you have skills on any one of these categories, you can build your own course and sell that. Now, this especially is going to work for people that already have a reputation or that already have a personal brand that is going on for them. Because if you already have that personal brand, if you already have that established reputation, then getting people to buy your course is going to be really easy. Now, to actually do all of that, you need to head on over to udemy.com and then click on teach on Udemy on the top right. From here, click on get started and you have a couple of different options. You can continue with either Google, Facebook, or your email address. So I'm gonna proceed with Google just to make my sign up a little bit quicker. And I'm just going to continue my account creation with Google. Now, once you have created your account, you're going to log into the account that you just created on Udemy. So simply type in your information and then you will be able to log in. I'm just going to add that over here. Okay, so I think I will, I will have to verify my account before I can proceed. Uh, I'm just going to verify my account on Udemy. So we're just going to go on ahead and check our mail like so. Oh, for some reason, this is not working. I think I'm going to have to go ahead and recreate my account like so. And then just create a suitable password and then click on sign up. And once we've done that, yeah, now we can proceed with setting up our account. So if you have done this type of teaching before, so let's say I've done online teaching and how much of a video pro are you? So let's say that we are experienced and then I'll just click on continue. Once we do that, you're going to add if you have an audience to share your course with. So let's say I have a small following and then I can proceed over here. Now, once we've done that, we can proceed with our course creation on Udemy. So on the left, you will have a tab for your courses, communication, performance, and tools. And to upload your own course, you're going to click on create your course. Now, once you click on create your course, you're going to structure it. So we want to create a course first, and then we're going to add a working title. So let's say that the title for our particular course is going to be how to behave elegantly. I don't even, I didn't even spell elegantly, right? So yeah, how to behave elegantly, a women's manner, mannerisms guide, like so. And I'll just make it a bit more appealing. In your title, you usually want to make all of the first letters capital other than, you know, your connecting conjunctions. But after that, you're going to add the knowledge category. So let's say this is personal development, and then I'll click on continue. Now, how much time can you spend creating your course per week? Let's say that I want to work five hours per week for creating this particular course. Now, once we've done that, you guys will see Udemy is going to ask you, uh, who is your intended learner? What is your course structure? What is, you know, your setup, you know, your setup going to look like and a test video. You have to complete all of this information. So you have to plan your course, create the content, publish your course, set a price for it, and then you submit it for review. Because Udemy does not allow just anyone to start uploading and selling courses. Your course content needs to be um, palatable. It needs to be something that is authoritative in its domain. So for that purpose, Udemy wants to maintain a quality control. 
and that is why they go through every course that is being uploaded to see whether it actually fits their guidelines and if it fits you know what it's supposed to teach so firstly you're going to add what will your students learn in this course so these are the first four learning objectives or outcomes so for that let's say this is going to be to define and understand what makes a elegant lady um and let's say it's going to be to emulate mannerisms and no social broco like so and then after that let's say to identify any mistakes in language uh, that hold them back from being elegant like that so you can you know add as many or as few as you'd like you have to add a minimum of four if you have more than four course objectives or learning objectives you can add more to your response now you're going to add any requirements or prerequisites to taking your course now if you're teaching an advanced level level course so let's say you're teaching a guide on how to increase sales and it's for experts and it's for people that already know all the basics so you want to add a prereq so anyone can join and you can add who is this for so this is for ladies who are looking to join high society let's say join high society and then once i've done that i can click on save and then move towards the next step the next step is to actually set up your course structure this includes an outline you have to you know add info about your course and you can go into their teaching center to better understand how you can do that then you have your setup and test video you have to create a test video then you can start filming and edit building your curriculum so your lectures any quizzes you have different sections and chapters you can include including coding exercises practice tests assignments lectures and then you can also add captions accessibility options and then you will build your course landing page price your course and then submit it for a review and that is how you can upload a course that you want to sell on udemy so that was it for today i hope you guys found this video helpful make sure to like this video and subscribe to the youtube channel and comment down below the best tips and tricks that i have taught you within this video and make sure to also share this video with your friends and family and to other creators as well so you can help them out as well and to anyone that might need to know this basic detailed platform and how you navigate through these different social websites so i hope this was helpful enough for you and make sure that you do leave a comment down below if i missed out on anything and if there is anything you would like to add and i will catch you guys in the next video